Ladies and gentlemen, and all assembled devotees, please welcome to New Braj's evening play. Um, the title of the play is called The, um, um, the Story of Sri Vas Thakur. <clears throat> For one full year, in the evening twilight, within the privacy of Sri Vas Pandit's courtyard, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu engaged in Hari Kirtan with the most advanced devotees in Navadvi. Becoming madly intoxicated with ecstatic love, the assembled devotees completely forgot themselves and incessantly began to dance and chant wildly, completely surrounding the Chitaka. <laughs> Absolutely. As long 
long as we're in this material body, we have only to develop our love for Sri Krishna, knowing him to be our real friend, our real wealth, and our ultimate life and soul. Even if your son is sitting on your very lap, still you cannot protect him. But when the consequences of his past fruit of reactions take effect, then this material world will be finished and he will be on your lap no longer. In this material world, so many living entities become absorbed in these temporary relationships, happiness, and distress. And they're now being degraded into lower species of life falling into illusions far, far away from Krishna's lotus feet. So now, give up your useless lamentation and become absorbed in the ecstatic chanting of Krishna's holy name, which is going on from within your own courtyard. Why are you exclaiming, my son, my son, my son, in great sadness, Krishna has only taken his own devotee to suit his own purposes. Don't you believe in Krishna? Krishna is the cause of all causes. And everything is taking place according to his own desires. We do not understand the whole purpose of this material world. And it is foolish to think that we do. So now, please become absorbed in the lotus feet of Sri Krishna and absorb your mind in the transcendental kirtan. Then all your material illusion will be gone and transcendental happiness will be yours. Now, my dear ladies, let me tell you one more thing. And by hearing this, all your lamentation and grief that is in your heart will go away. My son has died while hearing the ecstatic holy names of Sri Krishna. <laughs> he has also died in this transcendental land of Sri Navadvi. Therefore, he must have died while being absorbed in transcendental love for Krishna. Should any of us be so fortunate to die in this wonderful way, then we certainly, we will certainly cross over the ocean of materials. Now, my dear ladies, please, please, come back to the kirtan and absorb yourself. feeling some sadness here. Am I, Sad going to I perceive that something Mommy. most unfortunate has happened in this house today, and it's interfering <laughs> with my bliss. What you tell you? This son of Srinivas Thakur has just left his body during our kirtan. Oh, my heart.
heart is pierced with unbearable pain. Why was I not told of this when it first happened? Oh, my dear Lord, I could not bear the suffering that would hit my heart if I would have disturbed your ecstatic kirtan. Only one of my sons has died, and that has not given me much suffering. Even if all my sons were to die, still I would obtain more than enough transcendental pleasure by seeing your lotus feet. That, my dear Lord, that is why I did not tell you of this bad news. Because I know I would have died on the spot if I would have disturbed your kirtan. Let us go. Oh, my dear Lord. My dear Lord, if you will now give us permission, we will take the boy to the Ganges to perform the proper funeral ceremony. Let us go see the dead son of Shivas. My dear boy, why have you left so suddenly? Please tell us. Why is it that you've left behind your loving family? <sighs> My dear Lord, you are without doubt. <laughs> Staying true, unlimited, and without competition. Since you are the source of all energy, you can accomplish anything you please. Life and death belong to you, and you control everything by your multifarious potency. Neglecting your lotus feet, I have become completely ruined, falling down due to the dazzling bewilderment of fruited game. I have been captured by illusions in this mundane world. Wherever you send me next, O oh Lord, I must certainly go to be someone's son, husband, father, or daughter. I have no idea what kind of pious credit I must have earned to be born as the son of a great devotee like Shivas Pandit, and to bring the holy abode of Navadri. O oh Lord, if it is your desire that I should take another birth, I humbly request that you always allow me to be situated in the transcendental loving service of your divine Lord Spirit. Uh, hey, uh, <laughs> you are indeed my most wonderful devotee. Indeed, it is because of your love for me that I stay in this material world. Now, <coughs> let us go to the Ganges. We will have ecstatic kirtan. And we will give this boy to Ganga Mai. Yeah. Yeah. Hari Hare Namah Krishna.
Chaitanya Bolo, Nasreya Try to learn something. <laughs> what Chaitanya Mahaprabhu told. And quickly Ganges came. <coughs> and if anyone touched in Ganges water, he, he goes to Bakunt. And especially Chaitanya Mahaprabhu touched the boy, the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Where he will be? Not in this world. At once, quickly, he will sprinkle his mercy to become a very pure devotee anywhere, or at once go to Vrindavan, Braja. He will have love and affection for Krishna. So, this boy is very fortunate to become a son of. Always taking the remains of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu there. Also, the nephew, dot. Daughter one? Narayani. 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 Yes. <coughs> Taking remnants of Mahaprabhu. And he gave birth of? <coughs> so all the members of the Sivas Pandit became or were the associates of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. We should try to be like that. Son is dead. But no problem, no limitation. And if they were doing, but Srivas was so a strong devotee. Hmm? He was so poor. Hmm? Nothing to eat in evening or in morning. But he ate with four brothers and family. At the whole night doing Kirtan by Karta. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Three manas shiksha every morning. He began this morning. So, if anyone would like to get this book, it's available at the book table now. It's only six dollars, so you can follow along with all of the slokas. Hare Krishna.